Chuck Wagon MTG is sponsored by BC Comics and Games. Hey everyone, thanks for joining us for another great video here on Chuck Wagon MTG. Today we're going to be opening up a bunch of packs for patrons, but before we do that, we're going to crack a few packs to put into our Patreon build a pack box. So uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into that. Uh, so this is what we got. We're going to add these couple in, uh, mainly because uh, I've got a bunch of the 13 laying around. I just want something to kind of do with it. So. Uh, essentially we're going to get the good stuff and put it in. Well, actually all this is going to go in. Uh, we'll just do a quick look through there. This is all going to go into the common spot. Uh, no. Eh, eh. And then this, hey, we got a Herald of Anguish. That is a mythic going in there. And then these will be put over to the side. So we do have a mythic going in, so that's kind of nice. And, oh, that's right, these M13 packs are harder to open than the, uh, the regular, the new packs nowadays. Uh, all right, we'll go ahead and just skim through this. Uh, we got Jade Main Tome, oh, Oblivion Ring, that's kind of nice, and then we got a Battle of Wits. Um, yeah. Let's see. I don't, I don't. I don't think Oblivion Ring. I'm pretty sure that's not over a buck. Um, and even if it is, we'll still throw it in the common slot. All right. Let's see. What we got that. Hey, right off the bat, we got a negate. I mean, it's not worth anything, but that's kind of an iconic card. Hydro Surge. That's. Uh, I know that's using a popper deck or two. Smelt. There we go. All right. We got an acidic slime. That guy's nice. Uh, Crusader, Jace's Phantasm, and then we got a Sands of Delirium. And then we got a foil back here too, I am pretty sure. And our foil is, uh, hey, a foil rare uh, Fervor. Um, you know what, real quick, I'm just going to double check and see what that uh, is currently at. Listen, just to, just to double check, I just want to see. All right, what do we got? Uh, let's see. I apologize, folks. I should have had this uh, ready. I'm going to say, I honestly have no idea what uh, this card is at. Uh, hey, it's two and a half bucks. Not too shabby. And, uh, you know, while we're at it, we're just going to look up... Uh, Just double checking what Oblivion Ring is currently at. Yeah, that's still that's not even close. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, oh, did that wrong. While I've got it open, I'm just kind of curious what Battle of Wits is at. Because uh, I remember a while back there there it was a deck. Like, it was a thing, uh, but no, it's not a thing anymore. So, anyways, okay, we're done looking that stuff up. We're going to go ahead and uh, we're going to pull out our Build-A-Pack box. And y'all are going to see me, see me add to this right here in front of your very eyes. Uh, so we're going to grab our special color-coded sleeves. Um, you know, we're going to go ahead and put the foil rare into the foils. And, oh, that's right, I forgot this thing is kind of packed right now. So we're going to take that out. <laughs> wow, I forgot how full this thing is. Uh, I am actually in the process. I'm going to be switching to a uh, a larger box here soon. Um, but before we do this, since I just added a card, I just want to give this a, a quick shuffle. Make it all nice and mixed up. Alrighty, so we got that. And then we're going to go ahead and take the rares we got here. Uh, we need this type of sleeve. Looks like I got it all kind of color coded or whatnot. Herald of Anguish. I wonder if that's. 
for some reason it's sticking out of my head that's worth something, but I want to say it's not. Anywho, alright, so we're going to grab them here. We're going to throw them into our stack of rares. One, two, and three, and then we're going to give it a good shuffle. And then we're going to move on to uh, picking our cards for all of our uh, our patrons. And as you'd see by the, uh, we had a special video put out um, some other point in time this week, I believe it was. Um, you get you got to see the uh, we opened up some uh, Ultimate Masters packs, and uh, we had some rather good hits. Uh, that were put into uh, the Patreon Build-A-Pack box here. So that's fun stuff. All right, the rest of this is, uh, we'll deal with this later because this box is honestly pretty full. Um, like I said, we are going to be moving to a bigger box here soon. So um, let's go ahead and get this started off now that I'm like already six minutes in. Holy cat. Uh, we're going to start off with uh, Jared Hanna. Jared Hanna, thank you very much uh, for being a patron. He is uh, in our Fat Pack tier. Um, so he gets, now he is opted to not actually get a physical Fat Pack this time around. So he's just got this big old stack of cards. Uh, but first we're going to go ahead and we're going to build him is Build a Pack Box. Uh, this comes with every tier, $10 and up. You get the Build a Pack thing going on. So you get two rares. You get a common on common worth at least a buck you get a random foil and you get a random foil basic and then 10 common uncommon cards right here now occasionally we have uh, bonus prize cards in here you can win an extra pack of standard you can win an extra foil extra rare um one two three four five i lost count um lots of extra goodies in here six seven eight nine and ten and then we got random we got foils just kind of thrown in here um along with extra rares and just whatever good stuff all right let's go ahead and see what we got out of here we got a goblin locksmith a malevolent whispers uh ikitan crier uh we got a dwarven hold that's not too bad right there we got a blade tribe berserkers we got a uh scornful egotist Okay, um, we got a Sonic Burst, a Selesnya Guildgate Giant Spectacle, and a Faith Fetters. All right, for our random foil, we got a Foil Arrest. That's fun. Foil Basic. Uh, we got an Island from what was it Shadows? Pretty sure. Our common or uncommon. Oh, we got the uh, Alliances uh, Gorilla Shaman, the one holding the baby. Uh, that's the, the good one. That's kind of nice. Our first rare is a Bone Horde. And our next rare is uh, Voldaren Pariah. Alright, well those are your cards, sir. And then we are going to pull a card to autograph for you as well. Um, in fact, that's going to be, we'll pull out of the pile here, um, Noble Templar. This is going to be the card we're going to autograph for you and send your way. So first off, we've got a pack of Ixalan. Okay, for the sake of the video, we're going to skip past all of this. See if there's anything good. Not really. Walk the Plank is not bad. Chart, of course, is not bad. And we got a Vana Butcher of Magan. That is kind of awesome. Mythic off the bat. We'll go ahead and put this aside. I'll go ahead and include these two uh, uncommons if you'd like. Uh, I don't even think they're worth anything, but they are played, so that is kind of nice. Next up, we got a Dominaria pack for you. Uh, same thing, skip through this because there's really nothing in there. Uh, we got a Memorial of the Genius, this, a Thalid thing, a Seal Away, that's not too bad. And then we got a Foil Dub, that's nice. And then we got an Evra. Uh, Hyklon Halcyon Witness. I think that's how it's pronounced. Alrighty. Tell you what, not doing too bad. Get a foil off that. Alright, now we're on to the Guilds of Ravnica packs. 
um, which is going to make up the rest of the, the stack here. Uh, so far, we're not doing too shabby. Almost went too far. Uh, we got a Crater Maker. No. Molder Hulk. No. Inescapable Blaze. No. Okay, our rare is Aurelia Exemplar of Justice. Look at that. And a Foil Omnispell Adept. Love this card. Got a Mythic and a Foil Rare. Same pack. Winner, winner, chicken dinner is what we are going to call it. That was good stuff right there. That really was. Okay, let's see what we got here. Um, Boros Challenger, Discovering Dispersal, City Watch, Sphinx, and we got a Chromatic Lantern, and I think we got another foil. We did. Holy cats. Unexpected Disappearance. Man, you are slaying it today, sir. Good stuff. Good stuff. All right. We got here. We're no, oh, we're at ten minutes. I need to hustle this. Okay, we got uh, Golgari Raiders, uh, Beam Splitter Mage, not worth anything, but I like that guy. Enhanced Surveillance, and then our rare is Izoni Thousand Eyed. Yeah, we are not doing too shabby. All right, <laughs> Crackling Drake, not too bad. Smelt. Ward Minotaur, Sprouting Renewal, and we got another flipping foil. We got a Niv Mizzet Param and a Foil Grappling Sundew. Man, knocking it out of the park today. You really are, sir. I mean, nothing over the top, just a bunch of solid little stuff. Another Crackling Drake, Gatekeeper Gargoyle. Demir Spy Bug and a Dawn of Hope and another flippin' Ho oh, oh, oh. ho ho! Man! Under Realm Lich Foil. Need to go out and buy some lotto tickets because you are on fire. <laughs> Holy cats. Oh man. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. We got a Price of Fame, no, Silent Dart, Golgari Fine Broker, and Erratic Cyclops. Two more packs to go. I don't even know what the price of some of this stuff is at, but I get a feeling you beat the spread. Uh, the affection, Affectionate Indrick, Thoughtbound Phantasm... Status and Statue, and a Blood Operative, and I thought we had another foil for a second. I was going to be like, good lord. Alright, last pack to top this off. Let's see what we can pull out of this. Uh, we got a True Fire Captain, a Daza Marshall, Marshall, Flight of the Equinauts, and a Quasi Duplicate as the rare. Alright, we're going to throw this stuff to the side. You didn't do too bad, man. Um, I'm going to call that right now. Uh, I mean, wow. So, Quasi Duplicate, uh, Blood Operative, no. This sexy beast, right there. Uh, two packs in a row with Crackling Drakes. That's kind of nice. I uh, got the Niv Mizzet. I mean,. Chromatic Lantern, I mean, that's, that's always a good one to have. Arella, man. Man, oh, man. <laughs> good stuff. All right, we're going to go ahead and put this aside, and congratulations, sir. All right, next up, we have got uh, Adam Brody is going to be next. Uh, go ahead and build him a pack out of this box here. We got one. We got two rares. Got ourselves common or uncommon. A basic foil. Or I'm sorry, a foil. A foil basic. And then we got one, two, three, four. I'm going to put that one back because I don't like grabbing them all together. Um, let's see, we got five, six, seven, eight. Nine and ten. 
All right, let's see what we got here. Oh, no, I already showed it to you, so you may as well just you know, go ahead and show it. Here's the foil basic, uh, Amonkhet, pretty sure. Uh, forest, so that's kind of nice. All right, let's go ahead and look through this. We've got a Skylight Legionnaire. We've got a Might of the Masses, a Duress, Lingering Phantom, uh, Wish Coin Crab, Glorious Charge, a Muse Drake, a Cast Down, that's not too shabby, uh, Swarm Guild Mage, and a Conclave Cavalier. All right, our random foil is a uh, Ravaging Riftworm. That's kind of nice looking. All right, our common or uncommon is a Core Tapper. Uh, Battle of Wits, one of the ones we just opened. And then our next rare is Rite of Belzenlock. All right, well, those are your cards. Good, sir. Go ahead and put those right there. And then we got four packs to open for you. All right, skipping through. Uh, Affection Indrik. Enhanced Surveillance, Book Devourer, and Bounty Agent. Oh, there we go. Now we're thinking with power. I say, thank you very much, Adam Brody. It is greatly appreciated you being a patron, helping support this channel and all the great stuff we try to do. Uh, do, 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 do. There we go. All right, we got an Electrostatic Field. We got a Beacon Bolt. Creeping Chill, and a Null Hide Ferox. And I think we did. We got a Foil Command the Storm. All right. So far, good amount of Mythics that we're seeing. I'm digging this. All righty, all righty. All right, we got Invert uh, and Invent. We got Guild Summit. We got Discovery and Dispersal, and we got a Legion War Boss. That's not bad at all. See what other good stuff we can pull out of here. All right, we got a Conclave Tribunal. That's not bad. We Dragonauts. Book Devourer, and we got a Risk Factor. Very nice. And we got another Foil, uh, Barrier of Bones. Very, very nice. Well, congratulations, sir. That doesn't seem like it was too bad of a stack of cards. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, next up, just so I'm trying to speed this along because we're already at 17 minutes. Holy cats. Uh, we have got Golden Bohunsky. Thank you very much, sir, for being a patron. Uh, he is also at our, uh, our $20 tier, along with Adam there. We're going to grab him two rares. We got a uncommon or common, random foil, basic foil, and then we're going to do 10 out of here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and pull right off the back 10. Let's go ahead and see what we got here. Uh, we got an Electrostatic Field. We got an Acidic Slime. Rock on. We just saw that guy get put in there. An Encrust. Uh, Archaeomancer. Uh, Resplendent Griffin. I like that card. We got a Mighty Leap. We got cards we're skipping. We got a District Guide. Uh, Death Denied. I like that card. A Plated Rootwalla. And a Velk Videlkin Entrancer. Our basic is from uh, Fate Reforged. We got ourselves a Foil Thought Erasure. That's kind of nice. Uh, Eternal Witness. That's a nice one. Uh, Experimental Frenzy is our first rare. And our next rare is Master of the Pearl Trident. Love me some merfolk. All right. First pack. Oh, you know what? I forgot. Uh, this right here is going to go to uh, to Adam. Uh, autographed and then uh, our next one because Golden said he wanted one as well we're going to do a scornful uh, egotist is the card we're going to autograph for him 
All right, let's go ahead and cut through that. So right off the bat, we got a Lava Coil. That's not too bad. Uh, Night Veil vale Predator, Conclave Guild Mage, and a Sacred Foundry. Well, look at that. Holy cats. I think we're doing pretty dang good today. All right, skip, skip, skip. Uh, we got a True Fire Captain, Inspiring Unicorn, Street Riot, and a Drowned Secrets. I'm a fan of that card. I really am. All right, what do we got in this next one? We got a Demotion, uh, Creeping Chill, Hellkite Whelp, and our rare is Night of Autumn. Okay, that's not too bad at all. I honestly don't know where prices are sitting at because I really haven't been paying attention the last couple of weeks. A lot of stuff going on, but I think it's still a good card. All right, we got a Swarm Guild Mage, Sinister Sabotage. That's not too bad. Uh, Swath Cutter Giant. And, oh, we got uh, Expansion and Explosion. That's that's not bad at all. All right. Well, there you are, Mr. Bohunsky. Congratulations. I think you have to it. Thank you very much for being a patron. It is greatly appreciated. All right, next up we have Mr. Arter Isakon. Thank you very much for being a patron. Uh, he is at our $10 level, so he gets himself a booster to build the pack box, and then two boosters as well. Got two rares. Foil. Almost forgot to grab the common or uncommon worth at least a buck. Foil basic, and then ten of these bad boys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Almost couldn't grab it. Nine and ten. All right, let's see what kind of fun stuff we got for Arter. Thank you very much for being a patron. It is greatly appreciated. All right, we got a uh, Crawl Harpooner. Got a Lot Left Giant. Love that card. Uh, Barrier of Bones. Ingot Chewer. Renegade Tactics. Plummet. A Foil Child of Night. Uh, an Eel Umbra. A Settle the Score. And, oh, a Foil Wind, Re Wind Reader Sphinx. Foil Basic is going to be a Forest from Dominaria. Uh, we've got Brain Freeze as our common or uncommon. Random Foil it the Fervor we just pulled at the beginning of the video. Sweet. Our first rare is Citywide Bust. And our next rare is... <laughs> winner, winner, Chicken Dinner, Selvala. Heart of the Wilds. Well, I, I'm actually, I just checked the price on this because uh, I'm looking for one for an EDH deck. That's over 20 bucks, so I think that covers <laughs> what you paid in this month. Congratulations, sir. Now let's see what we got in your packs. Good stuff. So much good stuff in this build pack box. I honestly forgot that was in here. All right. Uh, we got a League Guild Mage, uh, Ocarina Assassin, Pilfering Imp, and an Unmoored Ego. Man, Value City. This is this is turning out to be a dang good video. Normally we have one person that does like really well and everyone else gets. You, you, they hit the mark, but I mean, it's right around there. It seems we're doing good for everyone. I could be wrong. I hope I'm not. Uh, we got Undercity Necrolis, Rampaging Monument, Hellkite Whelp, and a Mnemonic Betrayal. Well, um, out of all that, two Mythics, not too shabby. Like I said, I know for a fact that uh, Salvalo there is over 20. Because I just looked at it. Good hits, good hits, good hits. All right, well, that does it uh, for what we're going to do today for our, our patrons. We've got more patron videos coming up this month, uh, so keep an eye out for that. Um, as you can see, I mean, we've got a lot of value here in our Patreon build pack box, and we're going to keep on expanding it with more and more great stuff. Um, 
if you're interested in maybe becoming a patron and getting a shot of this build a pack box you can see i said there's some good stuff in here uh go ahead and check out the link down in the description you can find our patreon page and all of our tiers that we offer um and then i think that's about it so if you like what you see here today do me a huge favor click that like button hit subscribe be sure to hit the bell notification button so you can tell when you're coming out with new stuff and then share this with your friends your family your loved ones and your pets everyone could use a little more magic in their lives. Once again, thank you very much for watching, and as always, you can find us on Facebook and Twitter, Chuckwagon MTG. Uh, do us one last favor and check out a brief message about the best gaming store in Michigan. Chuckwagon MTG is sponsored by BC Comics and Games, now at one mega location to fill all of your gaming and comic needs. They have Magic the Gathering events every night of the week, as well as Warhammer, Pathfinder, Dungeons and Dragons Adventures League, Final Fantasy TCG, Pokemon, and Star Wars X-Wing events all throughout the week. They also have close to 100,000 comics on site. This is why I have personally made BC Comics and Games my home gaming store.